Hello everybody, Brian Akins again, Rebel Relics, or now infamous Rebel Relic Redneck videos. Uh, got a counter full of brass and blades, guys. These are shotgun bayonets. Double barrel shotguns, uh, especially early war. Apparently they were uh, way more of them than anybody's ever thought. Um, I collect these. If you have any for sale, give me a shout. I'd love to love to buy your shotgun bayonet. A lot of people don't even know what they are. I go to a show and buy them. And they're like, man, what's that go on? Uh, these shotguns, and I have several of, have brass adapters at the end of the barrel. And they have two, two studs on them. And these lugs slide onto the studs and they're fastened with a spring clip there to keep the tension on it. I believe these are made by Cooking Brothers. There's two styles of these. Notice this one has the straight cross guard. And then this style here has a little bit different cross guard. And if you have uh, All Balls, one of his books, I think it's Confederate Weapons, you've probably seen this bayonet. It's the exact one pictured in his book. Notice the different style of blade and it's reversed. The cutting edge is up on this one. And it has the two Roman numerals that are photographed in the Confederate Weapons book by Bill Albaugh. These, these uh, bayonets are serial numbered. This one has a Roman numerals, of course, but it doesn't have any uh, numerical numbers like the rest of them. The style here with the turned up guard is right here, 113. The style here with the straight guard is serial numbered on the butt. This one is number 87. Guys, I don't claim to be no expert. I just love rubber relics. And I'd like to share this stuff with you. Here's a Doug example. I bought this one. People saw it on my table and I got an email. A guy said it was Doug at Shiloh, Tennessee from his memory. Nice early battle, very well could have been. Uh, still has one lug here. This one is gone and pretty flattened out. Of course, the blade is definitely excavated. And uh, it's the one with the serial number down here, just like the one that's still in very nice condition. So these two styles have the turned up guard the excavated one and this one, different style. Now here's one, guys, like these two. And I guess Johnny Reb might have got him a Spencer carbine or a Sharps carbine and got rid of that double barrel shotgun, wanted to keep his bayonet. So he filed the lugs off. The patinas are solid, no doubt. This is a period workmanship here on crafting that. Serial number 159. The blade's been shortened to a knife, side knife length. Confederate shotgun bayonets. How cool is that, guys? Guys, I collect the shotguns and I collect the bayonets. If you have any of these you'd like to sell them, give us a rebel yell. The phone number is 615-772-7008. We have two websites, rebelrelics.com and akinsamericana.com. Feel free to give us a rebel yell. Thank you.